Well, what I do know is um, yeah, there's a bit of rain in our uh, bowling, bowling innings right at the end of the, um, you know, the last couple of overs. So the ball was, we knew the ball was going to get a little bit wet for us anyway. But in the end, you've just got to make do with what um, conditions are um, given to you in the end. Um, you know, India did go in with, with um, three frontline spinners. So there's also a chance that there's going to be some rain around like, like there has been throughout the whole tournament so far, especially here in Colombo. So um, I suppose in the end, you've just got to make the most of the situation, the conditions that you've, that you've got and, um, and try and play as well as you possibly can, I suppose. Bills over the last few years as well, so you sort of know how they're going to bowl to me and how they're going to try and get me out. So um, it was um, nice that it you know, worked out well for me tonight, but um, you know, those guys in the past have got me out quite a few times as well. So Khan especially, he's a very skilled um, new ball bowler especially. So. Um, Look, in the end, we knew that that was going to be the attack, the more, more chance of there being three spinners. And um, you know, I've been, I suppose I've been lucky in a way that I've been able to play all, their, all those spinners um, throughout the IPLs over the last few years as well. So you sort of know how they're going to bowl to me and how they're going to try and get me out. So um, it was um, nice that it you know, worked out well for me tonight. But um, you know, those guys in the past have got me out quite a few times as well. So. I think chasing 140 was always... Um, going to make it a little bit easier for us in a way that um, that if you're chasing a, bit, a bigger total or much bigger total than 140, um, you, know, you do have to take a lot more risks to the spinners and um, you know, they are high quality, world class spinners that we are, we are playing against, especially Ashwin and Habajan who have played a lot before. So um, we knew that that was going to, be, going to be a really big challenge and it just worked out that you know, we, got, we got a few boundaries away early and um, we were able to try and make the most of those first six overs which, um, you know, it, it also helps having um, you know, Dave being a, well, the quality of player he is, but also a left-hander as well, because it obviously means that um, they can't just bowl you know, off, off spin to two left-handers or um, left-arm orthodox like you've Raj to um, two right-handers. So um, that certainly means you know, the, the team's, the opposition's makeup is going to probably um, be a little bit more well thought about anyway. It was a time where I was really able to um, get some training under my belt, um, get some physical, really physical strength and fitness, but also have a bit of a mental break as well to be able to, um, well, hit the hit this 2020 World Cup um, running. And the games in Dubai were were a brilliant lead up for us. The conditions that we had there, um, the heat as well to be able to adjust to that, like we have here. Um, and in the end, I suppose just things have fallen my way over the first couple of games here as well. It's cricket is, you know, very. It's a very fine line between having a really good game or having a not so good game. So I'm at, at the moment, a few things are sort of falling my way nicely. And I'm, you know, you've got to make the most of those times because there's always times when things don't go exactly your way. So, um, but fingers crossed, things um, will keep, continue to go okay for me over the, you know, and, and the team as well over the next few games because. Yeah, we've certainly got the um, quality of players to be able to have a lot of success in this tournament. We just need to continue to, to do everything we can to be at our best. Um, quite a bit. Being strong, obviously, is, is very important to be able to hold things together, especially being an all-rounder. But, um, but in the end, I suppose I'm, I'm lucky as well at the moment. I've got a very good bat as well, so that certainly helps. Um, if you sort of slightly miss hit one, it's going quite a fair way. So. Um, I'm praying that that doesn't break at the moment because I've, I've still got a couple more good ones, but make the most of them while you can. Well, that's that's the plan. There's no doubt about that. That's what we come in here for is to be able to you know, um, take that next step. Um, you know, we came up one one short la last time in um, in the West Indies against England in the final. But um, there's no doubt we've we know the quality of teams that are, that we're playing every single game now leading up um, leading up into the semi final. So we've got to continue to play some very good cricket to you know to try and get ourselves into the semi finals. And then you just hope that a few guys have a have a very good day out there and we're able to combine as a team as well in the in those two knockout games. So um, that's that's the plan. But we've still got a long way to go. There's no doubt about that. You can't get too low either. If you, if you get it around um, chest height, he can hit the ball a, a long, long way. So um, that was certainly one plan that we that we had and knew that that was going to be a way to be able to m more so try and just get a, a um, you know a dot ball or get you know no no run scored off the ball and um, 
and then it worked out that it has actually you know, got a wicket as well. But um, that's that's definitely going to be a lot of a lot of the team's plans as it has been for the last few years as well to, to view Yuvraj. But um, there's no doubt that the quality player that he, that he is, he's going to be able to. You know, he's going to have his day and get and get through that and you know, domi dominate um, a game like we've all seen throughout his career.